It's been a beautiful weekend in Duval so far. Hundreds of people right now enjoying the Jacksonville Jazz Festival in downtown. News for Jacks reporter Marilyn Parker is there. Marilyn, how are people feeling at the fest? Listen, I won't lie to you, it is hot, but there are a lot of smiling faces. Just look right behind me, Janice, and it's such a vibe out here. I love it. You you know, it's just so refreshing to see so many people come together. You see a lot of lawn chairs, a lot of umbrella, because like I said, it is hot. We are sweating out here, but the music has been good so far. We're kind of in between performers right now, but more is to come. And when I say more to come, I mean more people. You're seeing a lot right now on your screen, but they're still making their way into downtown to get here, especially when the sun's going to go down, like Danielle said, in that nine o'clock hour. So hopefully we will uh, have a nice cool down. But there are tons of food trucks out here as well. Lots of people supporting some of those local businesses. And now as far as safety precautions, they have people checking bags at the front entrances. And there are so many officers here inside and outside of the festival. Take a listen to what Sheriff Mike Williams told News for Jax about this weekend. Listen, I think uh, Jacksonville is a safe city. We have our challenges like every city does, for sure. Uh, but a weekend like this, should, you know, it should be exciting. You got a lot of great events going on downtown, a lot of people downtown. Uh, we have a lot of officers downtown to make sure these big events are safe. And even one of the performers before starting their set, they even went to mention what happened in Texas and in, in Buffalo. Then they started to sing and they said it's all going to be all right. And the crowd agreed. So coming up tonight on News for Jax at 10 and 11, we're going to have some more crowd reaction because people are, again, happy to be out here. But listen, if you can't watch at 10 and 11, I hope that means you're on your way to the Jazz Festival. I know, Janice, you're probably jealous of me right now, but I'm going to have a good time for the both of us. All right. <laughs> Reporting live downtown. Maryland Parker Channel 4, the local station.